Hi everyone, it's Linda Brown here. Welcome to my kitchen. I am going to be cooking a brand new product from Epicure this season. It's called African Sweet Potato Stew. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up my multi-purpose steamer and I'm going to be chopping up two sweet potatoes and placing them in my steamer and then cooking those sweet potatoes for six minutes on high. So I have my chef knife here. Chop these guys up. Now I'm going to scrape them into my multi-purpose steamer. and cook them on high for six minutes. While my sweet potatoes are cooking, I have preheated my wok and I'm going to be cooking up half a pound of ground turkey. So what I'm going to do is take my Epicure flipper, just cut this package in half and pop that into the wok going to cook that up and then add a few more ingredients. My turkey is cooked so I'm going to add a can of diced tomatoes and a can of light coconut milk and my African sweet potato stew seasoning. Stir that together and we're going to let this simmer covered for five minutes. While that is simmering, I'm going to add a cup of Epicure broth mix. So what I've done is uh, measured a cup of water in my multi-purpose pot. And the great thing about these pots is that they have a colander built right into the lid. And the measurements are on the inside of the pot. So I'm going to take my four in one spice spoon and measure teaspoon of broth mix into the pot and then add that to my mixture and the reason why I use broth mix instead of water is because our broth is enhanced nutritionally with the with nutritional yeast, which is high in vitamin B12. And whenever I can add extra nutrients to my food, I do so. So I like to add the broth mix for extra flavor as well as enhanced nutrition. Our stew is simmering beautifully. So I'm going to take the lid off. And our sweet potatoes are cooked. I just wanna show you what they look like. Look how bright and beautiful those sweet potatoes are. When you cook your food in their own steam, your food actually retains more of the nutrients. So that's the great thing about these Epicure steamers because your food cooks in its own steam quickly. So we're going to add the sweet potatoes to the stew mixture. I'm using my ladle so that the hot stew doesn't bounce back and burn me. There's the sweet potatoes. And then what you wanna do is add half of a cup of crunchy peanut butter. You can also use a peanut butter alternative like sun butter, sunflower butter. So I'm using this three in one spatula. It's great for scooping and scraping. So that's about half of a cup. So add that to our stew. Give it a stir and we're going to let this simmer together for another two minutes and our stew will be done. 
Our stew has been simmering for another two minutes. Doesn't that look amazing? So now we just take our bowl, and this is actually six servings of stew, so you could eat half of it today and freeze the other half. So we're going to fill this bowl about three quarters of the way up. And there is our delicious African sweet potato stew. So yummy, I wish you could smell my house right now. Enjoy!